Now available in paperback and coming to Kindle Unlimited, John Haynes, Dark Succubus, the man who rules the world, is tempted by a sultry succubus in this all-new John Haynes series adventure. Get John Haynes, Dark Succubus in paperback or pre-order on Kindle Unlimited today. Why should you pick up John Haynes, Dark Succubus? Well, John Haynes, Dark Succubus is the second book in the John Haynes series and takes place right after events that went on in the first John Haynes book, John Haynes, A Conversation with Death. And John Haynes, A Conversation with Death is the first book in the John Haynes series, which reintroduces the John Haynes character to readers after the novel, The Man Who Rules the World, and the first novel that introduced the John Haynes character into the SJS Direct Universe, John, The Temptation of John Haynes. Now, John Haynes, Dark Succubus is the second book in the John Haynes series, and in this story, the man who rules the world, John Haynes, is tempted by a sultry succubus who seeks to take his soul by offering him a chance to live his dreams. And in this story, I explore what a man would do to get one question answered, and will he be willing to risk his soul to get that question answered? So in this story, we see the John Haynes character, a man who has everything, pondering whether or not he wants to compromise his soul just to get an answer to one single question. And the inspiration for this story came from something that I read in the Psalms and the Bible overall, where it said, there is a way unto a man that seems right, but the end is death. And I wanted to look at, explore that statement in the Psalms with this story, because when it came down to my own personal life, I always had this aspiration to be normal. But when I took a look at the Psalms, and I said to myself, you know, that way that seems right to men, it, it, may, it leads to death. And that's something that I wanted to make a commentary on in the story, Dark Succubus, about this way that men feel is socially acceptable to others, is right, but the end is death. And the death is not a physical death, it is a spiritual death because you are making a spiritual compromise to conform to the standards of the world and to conform to the standards of the world is something that can take you away from the living God and your relationship with the living God and that's what I wanted to make a commentary on with John Haynes dark succubus because when it comes down to the succubus this she demon she often appears to be attractive and oftentimes she looks to seduce men with her looks and in this case the succubus Celine she wants to seduce John Haynes not only with her extremely attractive looks but she wants to offer John Haynes something as related to his desires and this question he wants to get the answer to and she wants to use this as a way to tempt John into making this spiritual compromise that could cost him his soul and this is something that the demon wants to do because when it comes down to the succubus again this she demon she often makes things appear to be attractive and that's something that makes them extremely dangerous now this succubus does take John into the dream realm and a lot of the story takes place in the dream realm and I really want to make a commentary on how sometimes things that we see in dreams aren't really good for us as related to reality. So a lot of times we have these aspirations and imaginations of things and we think that they're the best things that we always wanted. But in this story, I want to make a commentary on how these things can take you out of your walk with Christ. Now, in John Haynes, I always try to make an effort as related to presenting a positive image of black men and I want to make an effort to show you a positive image of black masculinity and in John Haynes Dark Succubus I make an effort to really give you that image of that positive strong masculine heterosexual black man in John Haynes that we don't see in other forms of media because when it comes down to most mainstream images of 
black men in media, they make efforts to try to emasculate that black man, or they make efforts to neuter a black man, just like Marvel Studios did with Black Panther. However, with the John Haynes series, I make an effort to really show you a strong, positive, masculine image of a heterosexual black man and an image of a black man who is involved in a healthy relationship with a heterosexual black woman in his relationship with Easting. Now, as John Haynes is being tempted by this sultry succubus, his girlfriend, Easting, tries to find a way to get John out of the dream realm, and she tries to get John on track. And with the Easting character in this story, I wanted to show a positive example of a black woman in a healthy relationship with a black man. And as I see it, when it comes down to a healthy relationship between a black man and a black woman, they both work together to help each other. And sometimes we don't see the way a black woman helps a black man and, and when he's in trouble. And in this story, I wanted to show how a black woman helps a black man in ways that in many cases a lot of brothers don't know about or appreciate because when it comes down to the role of the woman a lot of times we don't really understand what a help me means and a help me is and with this story I wanted to show how the East Team character as understanding her role as a help me goes out of her way not only to support John but also goes out of her way to protect John because when it comes down to the role of the help me she is also she's there to help a man take care of his business but she's also there to help protect his interest and in some ways when she's out to protect those interests she can give a man perspective on things by giving him a, another look at things because as his right hand she can see things from a different perspective. And it's that perspective that really helps John out in this story, in dealing with this succubus, and it's the things that Easting does that really helps him find a way to overcome this succubus who is out to take his soul and out to destroy his life. So with this story, I really wanna show not only a positive image of a black man in an African-American fantasy story, but I also wanted to show you a positive example of ma black man and black woman in a relationship and show how black men and black women have to work together to support each other in overcoming the challenges of the enemy and overcoming the, the troubles of life. Because if the black man and the black woman, they don't work together and lean on each other, then they, don't, then they will both fall. So it's in this story, I really wanna show not only John Haynes being a strong masculine man, but I also wanna show Esteem as the kind of woman who, under, who goes out of her way to be that help meet and support. Because when it comes down to us in, in media, we not only don't get enough images of positive, strong, masculine, heterosexual men, but we also don't get enough images and stories featuring women who are going out of their way to support a black man as he's going out in this world and trying to find ways to keep him on track and on point. We don't get those type of images. We don't get those type of stories. And with John Haynes' Dark Succubus, I wanted to give people that type of story so that you can see the balance between a black man and a black woman and see how both complement each other and both help each other in doing God's work on earth. If you'd like to pick up your copy of John Haynes' Dark Succubus, you may do so by heading over to Amazon.com to pick it up in paperback. Right now, it's coming to Kindle and Kindle Unlimited on June 18th. And if you want to pick up the previous book in the John Haynes series, John Haynes, A Conversation with Death, it's also available on Amazon.com along with The Man Who Rules the World. And the first book that introduces John Haynes and the SJS Direct Universe to readers, The Temptation of John Haynes. You can get all of those books on Amazon.com by clicking the link in the description box. And I hope you enjoy all of the stories that feature John Haynes and the characters in the SJS Direct universe.
Now available in paperback and Kindle Unlimited, E-Steam Goddess of, Elle's aspiring angel takes on a demonic dominatrix in this action-packed all-new E-Steam series adventure. Get E-Steam Goddess of in paperback and Kindle Unlimited today.